incredible video tonight shows the moment students at Layton Christian Academy rushed to help a family pinned under this car. Fox 13 News reporter Darian DeBruel spoke to a Hill Air Force Base airman and the students who saved the family. New video obtained by Fox 13 News shows over 20 students and an airman rushing to lift the car off a family who was run over in the parking lot as they were leaving Layton Christian Academy. I came out those doors right here just chilling. I walked out, a bunch of people were just, there's a lot of commotion going on. People were just telling me to help, so I just dropped my stuff and went over. And I see kids just start trying to pick up a car, and I was like, okay, well, I guess I'm joining in. Let's pick up a car. Moments later, senior airman Dominique Childress realized there were people underneath the car. Bridget Ponson, an employee of the school, and her two-year-old son, Archer. Brightly, the three-year-old daughter was able to crawl out on her own. I noticed legs come out and, and I was like, oh my gosh, there's like an actual child under this car. Um, and so I was like, hey guys, chain, like, switch it up, grab the kid, let's get the car high enough so we can get the kid out. Somebody came, pulled the kid out, and then mom was able to get out 15 seconds later. The car is heavy, we do our best, and the moment that I heard the kids crying, it's like, oh, thanks God. He's good now. Lee and Christian Academy's head of schools, Chris Crowder, says the school is home to 300 students from 40 different countries, and there are often language barriers. But Childress says there were no language barriers when it came to saving lives. It's working together, right? I mean, you preach it in every asset of, of life, whether it's military or I know they, they teach the same thing in high school, right? Work together and you're going to be able to get something done. Uh, we did. Police believe son was a factor in the accident and say the driver has been cooperating. Crowder says the two kids are expected to be released from the hospital Wednesday. The doctor said it was a miracle that they didn't have um, severe life-threatening injuries. Um, the two-year-old actually had tire marks on his back um, and the doctors can't find anything wrong. Their mom has more serious injuries and has to have surgery, but the outcome could have been much worse if it wasn't for everyone who rushed to help. I'm very proud of our kids and I'm even proud of the driver who, who was behind the wheel. Like she immediately ran to help. Um, she just was blinded. I think it just shows togetherness and that God is really with us. The Layton Christian Academy community has set up a GoFundMe for the family. We'll have a link to it on our website, fox13now.com. In Layton, I'm Darian DeBrule, Fox 13 News, Utah.